Hey guys, here with another video. Uh, I'm extremely proud to announce that Adirondack Airsoft Reviews has been around for two years. Uh, and I know a lot of you are saying, well, you've had the channel since 2007, blah, 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 blah. I know I've had it since 2007. That I didn't post videos really back then. I posted a couple, uh, didn't have any subscribers. But two years ago today, June 12th, I posted my first Adirondack Airsoft Review. Uh, I made a bunch of them. Well, okay, maybe like four or five uh, videos on some guns I had. I didn't really have any amazing guns or anything. The best thing I had at the time was probably the UTG M3 shotgun. I had like some revolvers and some spring pistols and stuff. And to be honest, I'm not really proud of those videos. Um, they're they're kind of bad in my opinion. <laughs> Compared to what I'm doing now, I just try to forget about them and push them to the side. But I must have done something right because here, two years later, 12,000 subscribers, almost 12,000, and still rolling, and channel's doing amazing. So uh, I'm really proud of the ch where the channel is now, as opposed to where it was then. That was just kind of a side project back then, saying, yeah, I'll do a couple reviews, bring in some, v uh, just put up some more videos. Uh, hopefully it'll bring more views to my other stuff, and the reviews just took off on their own. So um, I just want to talk about some new updates to the channel. Thank you to everybody who's stuck with me the whole time, and welcome to all the new subscribers, all the new viewers. And so just a couple new things I wanted to talk about. Uh, one big thing I want to throw a huge shout out to is my fa uh, Facebook fan page. Uh, we have over 800 people who like Adiron Airsoft on Facebook. See if we can get that to over 1,000 within the next week or two. Um, so if you have a Facebook and you're not a fan or you haven't liked Adiron Airsoft on Facebook, Go check that out right now. I'll put a little uh, text down there, right there. Uh, what Just type Adiron Airsoft, Adiron Space Airsoft, in the search bar on Facebook. I'll put a link in the description. Click that. It'll take you directly there. And um, go like Adiron Airsoft on Facebook. If you live close to me, I announce pretty, pretty much all the dates that I will be at Combat City, whether it be the field or the arena about a week or two before I actually go, so you can go meet me out there if you want. Uh, I put up pictures, I talk to the people, I put up questions, whatever. All sorts of stuff. I'll try to be even more interactive with you guys on there. Um, but, you know, the fans of Adirondack Airsoft on Facebook get a lot more out of the channel and out of my Airsoft knowledge than the channel people do. Because, you know, I link all the videos there. If you don't want to go through your subscriptions box whenever I put up a new video, um, be a, like at on Airsoft on Facebook, be a fan there, and I always link my videos there too. First is the 10,000 subscriber giveaway. Now I know I'm almost at 12,000 now. Um, I started on April 20th. I, that day, that is the day I hit 10,000 subscribers. And so I announced the 10,000 subscriber giveaway, giving away some amazing prizes, which I'll show you a couple in a second. And uh, just click this link right here, and that will take you back to the original video where you can uh, check out all the original or all the rules and guidelines and stuff. I just wanted to, you know, give a quick shout out to that project again, being that the last day to submit your video responses to that video, your entries is June twentieth, which is in a couple days. So um, if you haven't yet submitted your video, then please go check that out now and uh, hop on that because time is running out. So uh, just a couple things. I'll show you the guns I'm giving away once again. Um, you can win things like this gun, this gun. I know a black shirt wasn't probably the best idea to wear for this video, but oh well. This gun. This gun is provided by airsoftstation.com, so huge thanks to Airsoft Station. This gas blowback pistol. Hopefully you can guys can get a good view of that. This was provided by evike.com. Huge thank you to them. And then, for my out-of-the-country viewers, you can win one of these two airsoft landmines. Now, these will be going to two different people. So, um, hopefully, that is enough incentive for you to actually spend a couple minutes, maybe an hour or two hours, out of your day to enter the contest. Um, let me put these down real quick. 
we are at over 100 entries, which I never thought we'd get to 100 entries. That's that's awesome. So uh, maybe we can get to 120, 150, who knows. So a uh, couple days left, please, before June 20th, please submit your reviews. Check that for all the information. Don't ask me any questions here in the description about or the comments about what, how to enter and all that. I'm just going to ignore it, probably delete it. Please, ask all your questions there, but watch the video first. I explain everything. I guarantee you won't have any questions. Well, I can't guarantee that, but watch that. So, uh, moving on. Green screen. Uh, I've gotten a couple people for my in my future videos that are like, Hey, can you use your green screen? I know you have one. You're, it's on all, almost all your videos. It's always behind you. What do you guys think? Leave a comment below. Do you think I should use the green screen in future videos? Do you think I should not use the green screen? And just leave it as kind of a blank green background. Or should I put like pictures and stuff? Maybe put a, a logo if I'm talking about a G&G &G gun. Put G&G's logo back there. Uh, I know some people do this stuff. Um, so, you know, normally I don't work on it. But I don't use the green screen. Should I? Just personal opinion. Do you want the green screen to be used for whatever reason? And, uh... I'll do my best to fill the demand. So, another thing I wanted to talk about, go check out the channel. Uh, I uploaded a new channel background, a new banner, a new little uh, link, little a small banner down on the left side of the uh, channel. And so definitely go check out the channel backgrounds and all that, because I spent a couple hours working on that, made it myself. And I'm very proud of it. I think it looks really good. So go check that out. Um, also, new intro. Uh, this is... Being that this is the going into the third year of Adarn Airsoft Reviews, this is the third intro. I'm sticking with the whole gun thing, and um, I'm not sure when I put up the second one. The first one was just a basic pistol shooting with the Adarn Airsoft Reviews. The second one was the Mac 11 with the Adarn Airsoft Reviews and Inventions, which uh, I like that one a lot. I got a lot of comments about that one. People love that one. So hopefully you will like this new one, which I will play right now. Okay, so tell me what you think below in the uh, comments, what you thought of that. Did you like it based on, you know, one through three, rank the three different um, intros. Which one do you like the best? If you haven't seen the other ones, go watch some of my older reviews and you can see them there. Another thing is a lot of people have been asking me when the next fan video is. And, um, you know, I, what are we on? Seven or eight fan video number seven or eight, maybe nine. I don't keep track of the numbers until I have to actually make the title for it. But um, please, go submit your pictures to adarnairsoft at gmail.com, A-D-E-R-O-N-N-A-I-R-S-O-F-T at gmail.com. Um, but uh, doing a fan video right now. If you've already submitted pictures since between now and the last fan video, um, then don't worry, I still have them in my inbox. But if you have new pictures, if you want to send them, before you do that though, please be aware Please, please, please put your channel name in the subject bar or in the actual message of the um, email, preferably both, and then attach your pictures. If you don't put your channel name in the, um, in the email anywhere, then I won't be able to put it in within the rest of them. I'll just have sort of a no-name section at the end. So, um, like if I was submitting a picture to the thing, then... <laughs> If, it, if somebody else were hosting it, I would send them an email, I would put in the um, subject, I would put uh, fan video, channel name Adderon, and then like in the actual body of the message, I would put a, here's my channel name, in quotation marks, Adderon. And uh, then I would attach my pictures below. So uh, please do that, I'd appreciate it. Don't tell me, you know, that you've already sent a message and that it's the same uh, channel name as before because I'm not gonna go and look up your other one Just tell me flat out in that message that email right there what your channel name is and I will be sure to include them all um, So hopefully we can get some good pictures of that if you have like a picture of you holding your gun or just a picture of your guns Or a picture of your team don't send too many of the same picture maybe send three to four pictures max for each um, if like for each person, just send three to four pictures max. 
um, don't send me 12 to 15 because I'll just take the best ones and put them in there. Another thing, I got a new camera. Tell me what you think of the, um, the video quality. Is this video quality nice? Can you see me clear? Can you read the words on my shirt? It says Adidas. Um, I'm also, since it's a new camera, I'm not sure if I've inverted the video properly. This is my right hand, this is my left hand. I don't know if this looks like my left hand and can you read this properly? So tell me in the description, although I'll know when I edit the video, but tell me what you think of the new video quality. Um, hopefully this will give you a better picture of uh, the airsoft reviews of the guns. Just hopefully you like it and uh, get everything worked out. I will be filming game videos now. Um, being that this is a nice new camera, it's small, it can fit in my hand, and as I'm like going around filming games and stuff, I will do my best to at least film a little bit each time I go airsofting or every other time. When I go out to the field, although it's now in Florida, summer, it's extremely hot, but uh, I, I will try to do my best, I'll, well I will do my best to get out there and at least play a little bit and then film some games. Uh, also with the new Combat City CQB Arena, um, I go there almost like every other weekend or every weekend now. So. Um, I'll try to film a couple games there. So, um, thanks for watching. I'm also getting a new gun. I forgot to tell you guys that. It's not here yet. Click this video or this link right here, and um, that will be a big announcement. I'm excited about this gun. Um, you know, I, on my Facebook thing, which I talked about, um, if you're not a fan yet, or go like Adoran Airsoft on Facebook, uh, I put up a picture of my armory wall with a big blank spot in the middle for where my gun's gonna go and said uh oh what does this mean blank spot in the armory what do you guys think is gonna fill it and uh, so a couple people have actually guessed the model of the gun a couple people have guessed the maker or the uh, manufacturer nobody nobody's guessed the correct manufacturer and uh, brand or model of the gun so um, click that and that will take you to the announcement video once I do get it for now it's there's nothing gonna be there but um thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe and um leave comments below what you think about whether or not i should use the green screen what do you think of the new video quality uh, what do you think of the new intro and all that sort of stuff and if you haven't uh submitted a video response to the giveaway please do that now you only have a couple days left and some great prizes uh click that video or that link so uh, i will see you guys later